ARCHICAD Collaboration Interactive Training Guide Chapter 1 Introduction to the Project Welcome to the ARCHICAD Collaboration Interactive Training Guide. This interactive training guide was written to speed up and ease your learning process, saving you time and effort. Please watch the movies in this short introduction to familiarize yourself with the interactive training environment of Graphisoft ARCHICAD. Step 1. Getting started with the ARCHICAD Collaboration Interactive Training Guide. In this step we will learn how the interactive training guide is structured and prepare the ARCHICAD environment to begin the guide. This advanced ARCHICAD training guide has been divided into two parts. Chapters 1 through 5 explain ARCHICAD's teamwork features. Chapters 6 through 10 deal with other collaboration possibilities. The two parts can be downloaded and installed separately from Graphisoft.com. Each part of the ARCHICAD training guide contains a printable PDF document explaining every step of the exercise with screenshot illustrations. These PDF guides provide not only illustrated step-by-step -step instructions on how to complete the exercises, but also detailed explanations about the applied design concepts and features of ARCHICAD. Narrated QuickTime movie clips can also be displayed, providing step-by-step -step instructions to complete each step. These movie clips can also be opened from the PDF guides by clicking on the movie icons at the titles of each step. It's recommended, however, to play the narrated movie clips within ARCHICAD while completing the exercises using the ARCHICAD training project files provided. If you do not have ARCHICAD yet, and you are a teacher, student, or representative of a school, please visit myarchicad.com to register and download a fully functional education version of ARCHICAD for students, teachers, or schools. If you are a professional architect, visit myarchicad.com to register and download a fully functional 30-day trial version of ARCHICAD. Projects saved with this trial version can be automatically upgraded to full versions upon purchase of a commercial license. Start the Graphisoft ARCHICAD installer and follow the installation wizard to complete the process. In case you have not done so already, please install the interactive training guide on your computer as well. We recommend you install the guide to the default location suggested in the installation wizard. Also, please note that ARCHICAD is available in several localized languages for both Macintosh and Windows operating systems. Make sure to choose the language and installer version that best suits you. Once you have successfully installed both Graphisoft ARCHICAD and the Interactive Training Guide package, start ARCHICAD on your computer by double-clicking its desktop shortcut. Use the standard profile for active work environment. Select the Open a Project option at the Start ARCHICAD dialog and click Browse to proceed. If you have ARCHICAD already open, activate the file, Open command for the same result. The chapters of this guide, by default, can be found in the Graphisoft folder on your computer located in the Applications folder on Mac or in the Program Files folder on PC. Browse this folder on your computer and open the Chapter 1 to 5 folder if you would like to know more about ARCHICAD's teamwork functions or any of the Chapter 6 to Chapter 10 folders if you're interested in other collaboration possibilities. Every Chapter folder contains one or more ARCHICAD solo project files along with library container files as well as other necessary files. The library container file, itg.lcf, contains all the necessary library parts which are used in the design. When starting work with a chapter, always look for an ARCHICAD solo project, PLN file, with the name col-xx.pln. XX represents the actual number of the chapter. The first five chapters are grouped together in one folder containing two project files. Start with col01.pln, 
and follow the instructions in the movies or in the PDF document. Select the COL1 solo project file and click Open to open it. ARCHICAD will now open the project file and load the library parts saved in the library container file. If ARCHICAD does not find the container file automatically, it will display a library loading report. To load the library parts needed, push the Library Manager button on the bottom of the report window. This will open the Library Manager dialog. To load the library container file, click the Add button on the upper part of the dialog and select the ITG Library LCF file in the opening dialog. An LCF file is situated in every chapter folder next to the solo project files. Click Choose in the bottom right corner of the dialog, then click Reload in the Library Manager. The first five chapters of this guide show the functionality of the new teamwork feature of ARCHICAD. They are built on each other, so please make sure to complete them sequentially. From Chapter 6 to Chapter 10, you do not have to follow this rule. These chapters can be completed in any desired order. You can select any of the chapter folders and open the ARCHICAD solo project files located in these folders. Now you are ready to start with the first step of the exercise, so let's open the corresponding movie clip. If the ARCHICAD movie player does not open automatically, open it from the Help menu. ARCHICAD will automatically load the first movie of the current exercise. Feel free to reposition the movie player on your screen or even resize the player window if necessary. If you're ready, click the play button to start the narrated movie clip which will guide you through the exercise. You can control the movie player with the movie player controls or with the additional buttons of your mouse while holding the cursor over the movie player window. Left click to play and pause scroll up and down for volume control or left and right for the player slider position and use the arrow buttons to switch between movies. One click will show the next or previous movie. With double clicks you can switch between the movies of subsequent chapters. All you need to do is repeat exactly what you see in the movie and naturally you can pause the movie at any time. You can also use the slider if you wish to play only a certain part of the training clip. These training clips always zoom in to the area of the ARCHICAD interface where you must complete the next action in order to proceed with the exercise. It is recommended to complete the exercises using a minimum 1280 by 960 screen resolution. Once you have completed the first step of the exercise, Click the Next button on your player or the right arrow button on your mouse to proceed to the next step of the exercise. The title bar of the movie player always displays the current chapter number, the total number of chapters, the current step number, and the total number of steps within the current chapter. Now that the training environment has been set up, you are ready to proceed with the next chapter of the guide. We hope that you will find this guide useful and will agree with what experienced architects worldwide say. ARCHICAD is easy to learn and fun to use. Please feel free to contact Graphisoft and its worldwide partners if you have further questions.